This is the Easy Pod, and it comes as a uh, setup ready for a pump filter, and we're going to change it now to a gravity feed system. So, we first of all need to remove the screws that are holding this overflow in place. Um, so we'll remove those uh, which I've already done and then pull out the top overflow section and then we need to go in and remove just simply lift out the grate and then finally which I've already done is loosen off this top fastener here so it, that top fastener is now loose we're now going to turn the entire pod upside down okay now it's upside down there's two support screws uh, for this supporting piece they need removing and then that piece can be taken off. Now that that support bracket's removed, the whole inside return assembly can be removed from the easy pod. So we're now going to we're now going to replace the pipe. You could see that there was a longer section that was going into the easier pod, and the smaller mm -hmm. section that was out. We're going to invert that, and we're going to put the smaller section into the easy pod center. So we've now got the longer section coming out of the easy pod. Okay, I've now reattached the pipe support and I'm going to turn the whole unit back the right way up and tighten up that rubber hose again. It is worth noting that when it comes to tightening this and removing this internal connector, a pretty standard size smallish screwdriver there still won't fit in, um, basically hitting this back to undo. So the only way to get in it was one of these short stubby screwdrivers. Just thought it was uh, worth pointing that out in case that stops anybody doing the job. And the final two steps now are to reinstall the uh, perforated pipe and it mentions in the manual with the perforations at the top which is how it was pulled out to be honest so that just goes back on in exactly the same way and then finally the overflow is going to be screwed back on at the top oops trying to get that the right orientation there you go finally the overflow screwed right on the top and there you go, conversion to gravity feed. Okay, hope that helped. Thanks for watching.